graduates and graduates. On behalf of the Social Influencer Program, University Ambassador Program, and the Insider HQ community, we are so proud of all of your accomplishments and wish you success in all of your endeavors. Congratulations! Congratulations. You, you did it! Did it. Hi, this is Janet in the Office of Student Alumni Affairs, adding my congratulations to the class of 2021. Congratulations, you all did it. Um, in the midst of a very weird year, um, your dedication, your perseverance to your degree should be celebrated. And so while I'm sad that we can't all gather together to celebrate, um, that doesn't mean I'm not celebrating where I am and I hope that you all are celebrating where you are. And um, congratulations again, your hard work and your perseverance have paid off. Hi, my name's Kristen. I'm the Senior Academic Advisor with the School of Health Sciences, and I just wanted to tell the entire class of 2021, way to go. Uh, you hung in there in a weird year, uh, but we're so proud of you. Congratulations, guys. Congrats, graduates. Roxanne Ferreira here from Career Services. I'm one of your business career coaches, and I'm here to continue working with you as you take the next steps in your career journey. I hope you take time to celebrate your amazing achievements. Congratulations. Hi everyone. I'm so happy to be able to share this special day with you. All of your hard work and dedication has finally paid off and now it's time to celebrate. And remember, if there's anything at all that I can do for you as one of your career coaches, please don't hesitate to reach out. Again, celebrate your accomplishments and congratulations, you made it.
Congratulations, Class of 2021. We're so proud of you and your accomplishments this year. We're sad that we couldn't be there to celebrate with you in person, but we hope that y'all have the best day for commencement today. And we're again, so proud of you. Congratulations, you did it. Hi everyone, Dr. Gary Deal here from the School of Business. Just wanna wish everyone a congratulations on your graduation. This is an exciting time and a door opening into new opportunities for everybody. We wish you all the very best and we look forward to seeing exciting things for everyone. Thank you for being a part of our APUS family and go get them, take care. Congratulations to the class of 2021 on behalf of your academic advising department. We are so proud of the grit and perseverance you have displayed throughout your academic studies. And look, you did it. You're a graduate. This is so exciting. We hope you take the time to really celebrate this weekend with family, with friends, over Zoom, however you like. And just remember, when you're ready to return for your next program, we cannot wait to support you and see you again. Congratulations, class of 2021. From all of us here in the Richard G. Treffrey Library and Treffrey Archives, well done. We are so proud of you. Your hard work, perseverance, and time spent researching in the library has paid off. Congratulations, AMU and APU 2021 graduates. Congratulations, class of 2021 graduates. My name is Amy Everson, and I'm coming to you today on behalf of the University Awards Committee and the Office of Student Alumni Affairs. I'm so pleased to be celebrating with you today. I would like to acknowledge the various faculty members, staff members, students, and members of the alumni community who received an award this year. Our University Awards program is a recognition opportunity that calls upon the university's core values related to scholarship and learning, service and leadership, and integrity and innovation. Congratulations for our many award nominees and selected winners. And again, the entire institution is cheering on all of our class of 2021 graduates. Enjoy your day.
Hi 2021 graduates, my name is Hannah Bai and I'm president of the Jewish Student Association here at AQS. On behalf of our organization, I would like to congratulate you on your success. 2020 and 2021 have been a hard year and the fact that you finished your degree path is amazing. So congratulations and best of luck on the next steps in your career. Congratulations, class of 2021. My name is Kim Slaughter, and I'm the career coach for the School of Security and Global Studies. You put in a huge amount of hard work, dedication, and time. You sacrificed. You put your education first, and now you get to celebrate. I am so excited for this opportunity to celebrate with you, and I want to wish you the biggest congratulations. I cannot wait to hear about what you will do next. Hello, I'm Michelle Newman. Assistant Provost and University Registrar. And on behalf of my team in the Office of the Registrar, I'd like to send a special congratulations to our 2021 graduates. You did it. You achieved your academic goals and you should be so proud of your accomplishments. I'd like to give a special shout out to my baby, Nichelle Scanlon, for your accomplishments and for achieving your academic goal. So very proud of you, sweetie. And I'd also like to welcome you all to our alumni community. We hope to serve you and see you soon as you continue your lifelong learning journey. Take care and congratulations again. Congratulations. congratulations. Hello from the STEM academic advising team. We are thrilled to share our congratulations with you today. This is an amazing accomplishment and we hope you spend some time to celebrate all your hard work.
congratulations, graduates. I'm Melanie. And I'm LaVarne. And we're the Office of Alumni Affairs. We want to celebrate you and all of your accomplishments. Woo! And we can't wait to walk with you on your alumni journey. Yes, and listen, we have so many great services and benefits available to you as new alumni, and we can't wait to share them with you as you get to know us. We're so excited to get to know you. So congratulations again, class of 2021. It's time, time to, to celebrate, celebrate you. you. Woo! Hi, my name is Michelle Watts, and I'm a faculty director for the School of Security and Global Studies. I just wanted to say congratulations to all our graduates. I hope you really take the time to celebrate with family and friends, and please know that we are cheering for you as well. A special shout out to our Honor Society graduates from Sigma, Iota Rho, Gamma Omega. Congratulations. I'm so excited to be witness to your accomplishments. My name is Ro Leathers from Career Services on the Career Exploration Team, and we are looking forward to working with you to explore where your new degree will take you and all the career possibilities ahead of you. Congratulations. Hi, everyone, and congratulations. My name is Anna, and I am part of the Career Exploration Team here in Career Services. You have completed an incredible chapter in your life, and I hope you take time to celebrate. I want you to know that our support for you doesn't end here. I look forward to working with you and cheering you on now and throughout every milestone in your entire career journey. Congratulations.
Dear graduates, I'm Ahmed Naman, Dean of the School of Science, Technology, Engineering, and Mathematics. Congratulations on earning your degrees. I'm proud of your accomplishment. You worked hard, you persevered, and you achieved your goals. However, having completed your degree programs does not mean that your learning should end. You must become lifelong learners. Continue to read and learn from people within your discipline and outside of your discipline. You have acquired some knowledge and skills. Now you must continue your journey to acquire wisdom. I wish you the very best as you go forward into this adventure. You did it. Hello, my name is Dr. Brian Freeland and I am the Dean of the School of Health Sciences. I am honored and proud to congratulate all of our graduates from our variety of health sciences degree programs. I encourage each and every one of you to take advantage of your opportunity to help shape, change, and improve healthcare and health-related challenges facing society through the knowledge and experience you gain through your academic journey. I also encourage you to be lifelong learners and consider coming back for your next degree and learning opportunity. Please stay connected with us through our amazing alumni programs. And lastly, to the class of 2021, congratulations on your academic achievement. You did it. Hi, I'm Dr. Grace Glass, Dean of the School of Arts, Humanities, and Education. Congratulations on finishing your degree. Your APUS degree has prepared you for a wide variety of careers that require skills in written and oral communication, teamwork, critical thinking, and problem solving. You can go anywhere from here. You did it. Hi, I'm Dr. Marie Harper, Dean of the Wallace E. Boston School of Business. Despite a pandemic, you made it. You rose to the occasion and can proudly say that you have crossed off another accomplishment from your bucket list. Each of you has a unique opportunity based on your experiences during the last year. Our society is looking for people just like you. Individuals that have taken the time to learn how to make things happen. Be the leaders that we so desperately need and make a mark for your legacy. Your APUS family is cheering you on. As we celebrate you today, we also join you and your family by anticipating what the next step in your journey will be. Best of luck with the next endeavor. You did it! Dear School of Security and Global Studies graduates, congratulations on your tremendous achievement today and welcome to our growing alumni community. The intellectual labor you apply to your studies within our school are critical to the security of our nation and I hope you use your new knowledge to help solve the complex problems facing our global community. I wish you all the best in your future endeavors and hope that you will stay in touch through our Office of Alumni Affairs. Once again, congratulations, you did it.
Hey, graduating class, this is Ashley Johnson, your secretary for WSTEM and AWIS here at APUS. First and foremost, I wanna say congratulations for completing this journey. This last year has thrown a lot of challenges your way and you pushed through them all to reach your goal. I wish we could be there to cheer you on in person, but know that even though this is virtual, we are all very proud of your accomplishments. On behalf of the Reed Book Club, I would like to extend our congratulations on your hard work, dedication, and accomplishments. Way to go, Class of 2021. Hello graduates, my name is Rachel Tollywall from Career Services, and I'm offering my most sincerest heartfelt congratulations at your momentous achievement. Pursuing higher education takes a lot of motivation and determination, and it has brought you here today, a university graduate. I couldn't be more excited for each and every single one of you. Congratulations. Hello, my name is Patrick Dyberg. I'm the Chief Technology Officer at American Public University System. I uh, just wanted to congratulate the whole class of 2021 from me and the entire technology team at APUS. Uh, we're proud of all of you. We're happy to share this day with you and um, we hope that you have a great day of celebration. I'd also like to take the opportunity to congratulate my wife, Denise, who uh, took her master's degree in nursing management. Uh, congratulations, Denise, really well done. Uh, to all of you, again, congratulations. Have a fantastic day. Hi, class of 2021. I am Chaplain Linda Meyer, and I am so excited for your graduation. I'm bummed that we weren't able to do this in person because graduation is like my favorite time of the year. But if there is any year that was tough to endure academics and life and still graduate, this would have been the year. So please know that you, if you can survive a pandemic, and online academics and everything else that happened this past year, you're ready for, for anything that life throws at you. Congratulations. Congratulations, class of 2021 graduates. My name is Amy Everson and I'm coming to you today on behalf of the University Awards Committee and the Office of Student Alumni Affairs. I'm so pleased to be celebrating with you today. I would like to acknowledge the various faculty members, staff members, students, and members of the alumni community who received an award this year. Our University Awards program is a recognition opportunity that calls upon the university's core values related to scholarship and learning, service and leadership, and integrity and innovation. Congratulations for our many award nominees and selected winners. And again, the entire institution is cheering on all of our class of 2021 graduates. Enjoy your day.
Congratulations, graduates. It's not easy, and yet here you are. Uh, and that is because of all of your hard work, which you should absolutely celebrate because you deserve it. Um, this is such a huge hard-earned success, and I hope you will properly take the time to really just savor this moment and to celebrate. We are so proud of you. I hope you're proud of yourselves as you should be. You deserve it. Um, I hope this is not the end of your learning, but if it is, I want to thank you for letting us be a part of this journey with you and for sharing this milestone with you. Everybody, be safe, be well, but most of all, congratulations to the class of 2021. Hi, I'm Jennifer Douglas, the Dean of Graduate Studies and Research. Congratulations to all of you in the class of 2021. Your grit and perseverance in this challenging time is amazing. You have made a commitment to better yourself with an education, and that commitment will change your life. To our master's graduates, you conquered graduate school, and I'm so proud of you for that. For our undergraduates, celebrate this achievement and consider AMU or APU for your next degree. We're here to support you in graduate studies when you're ready. Congratulations again. I'm Lacey from the Office of University Events, and I just wanted to congratulate the entire class of 2021 on this amazing accomplishment. We wish we could be celebrating with you today in person, but know that we are celebrating with you at home. We can't wait to see you next year in 2022. Congratulations, class of 2021. You did it. Hi, everyone. Congratulations. Happy graduation. This is Dr. Sandy Shaw from the Program Director for Entrepreneurship. Wishing you all the best and a huge congratulations. This is a happy time for you. And being a part of entrepreneurship, just remember everything started with the seed of an idea. Any product, any service you touch, you experience today, all started with that idea, that seed. So with whatever your goals are, take that seed, nurture it, grow it, and achieve all the goals and all the success that you want to have. I wish you all the best.
to all of you who are graduating today here at American Public University System. This is Dr. Jan Spencer commending you for your job well done. What a wonderful experience to come to the finish line of the and the realization of what you've been planning for and working for uh, during these number of months and even years. We are proud of you. My name is Sherry Denis and I'm a director here in academic advising at APUS. I wanted to extend a huge congratulation to all of the graduates and the class of 2021. This is a huge accomplishment and one that does not come easy. Your hard work and dedication has really paid off, so I hope that you take some time to really celebrate this amazing achievement. Myself and all of us in academic advising are so proud of you. Congratulations. Felicidades en esta fecha tan importante. Quiero felicitarles a todos ustedes, clase del 2021, por todos los logros, por todos los esfuerzos y por todos esos sacrificios que han hecho, pero principalmente por haber llegado a la meta. Sigan su camino con la frente en alto y con la certeza de que la vida les depara grandes éxitos. Recuerden que esto es solamente el comienzo de grandes experiencias en sus vidas. Y reciban un gran abrazo de mi parte. Muchísimas felicidades. AMU and APU graduates, I'll get to talk to you in a little bit, but I just wanted to take time to personally congratulate you and thank you for choosing American Public University System as your university. We're always here for you. Please stay in touch and let us know how we can serve you in the future. Thank you. Erin Kelly Bannister, I'm one of your academic advisors. 
in the School of Arts, Humanities, and Education. I just wanted to reach out and say congratulations, Class of 2021. This is an amazing accomplishment, and you made it. Hi, I'm Taylor. Hi, I'm Jessica. And we are your STEM coaches. We want to congratulate you on this amazing accomplishment. Hi, I'm Marsha. I work for Dr. Wallace E. Boston School of Business. I just want to congratulate everyone on your achievements and a big shout out to the School of Business graduates. Good afternoon or good morning. I'm Dr. Vernon Smith, Provost of the American Public University System, and it is my great pleasure to welcome you today to the Class of 2021 Virtual Commencement Ceremony. Each year we celebrate our graduating class. This year is even more special with the celebration of our 30th anniversary as a university. Founded in 1991 by retired Marine Corps officer James P. Etter, American Military University offered career-relevant distance education to a mobile population of military learners with unique needs. In our first 10 years, we added undergraduate programs and additional graduate-level programs to help prepare students for leadership roles, both within the military and for transition into post-military and public service careers. In our last 20 years, American Military University reorganized into the American Public University System, adding a new campus, American Public University, to provide the same high quality, affordable, and flexible education to a broader audience of working adults. Now in 2021, we are one of the largest providers of online education worldwide. We honor our past 30 years. We are proud to be a leader in higher education for anyone who seeks it. And we are proud to celebrate your milestone and achievement of graduation today. Even though we can't be together today, we can still find great joy in recognizing each of you, wherever you may be. We hope you're all able to celebrate this amazing accomplishment virtually. And when it's safe to do so, we hope you will celebrate again in person with all your family and friends. Our university's mission has always been to educate and support those who serve. This past year has definitely been challenging for our nation and the world. 
We know that many of you are home with your families today, but many of you are also still on the front lines, working in the healthcare field, deployed, delivering critical supplies and materials, and taking care of those who are ill and recovering. We applaud you during these hard times. It's because of your commitment to service that we continue to be inspired to fulfill our mission. We have a wonderful celebration planned for you today, including inspirational speeches from our president, Dr. Wade Dyke, a special keynote speaker, Lieutenant General Vincent Stewart, along with your class speaker, Mr. Eric Sneed. Every year, I look forward to these amazing words of wisdom as we send our newest graduates on to their next chapter, and this year is no different. While we are celebrating differently, I assure you that the messages are no less inspiring and heartfelt. I would like to introduce our distinguished colleagues that attend commencement every year. They are cheering for you from their homes today and wanted me to pass on their heartfelt congratulations. The members of our Board of Trustees include Chair of our Board of Trustees, General Alfred Gray, Vice Chair, Lieutenant General Thomas Conant, Lieutenant General David Huntoon, Dr. Barbara Kershon, Dr. Lucy Lepofsky, Dr. Mary Marcy, Dr. Katie Marie, Dr. J.D. Polk, Mr. William Robinson, Jr. Ms. Angela Selden. Lieutenant General Vincent Stewart. Dr. Catherine Zatz. Mr. Franklin Ball III, Member Emeritus. Lieutenant General Richard Treffrey, Member Emeritus. Dr. Wallace Boston, Member and President Emeritus. Members of our Board of Directors are Chair of our Board of Directors, Mr. Eric Anderson, Ms. Granetta Blevins, Major General Barbara Fast, Ms. Jean Holley, Dr. Barbara Kershon, Mr. Timothy Landon, Mr. Daniel Pianco, Mr. William Robinson, Jr., Ms. Angela Selden. In addition, our deans, our directors, our faculty, and our staff send you their warmest congratulations. They join us every year at commencement in support of our graduating class, and today they are posting those messages on our AMU and APU social media pages for you to view as you celebrate this milestone. In addition to the support you've received from the university, we hope you'll take some time today to especially thank those around you who helped you achieve this accomplishment. It takes a great deal of dedication on your part to complete a college degree, but it also took a great deal of love and support in order to reach this accomplishment. Today, please take a moment to thank those spouses, partners, loved ones, parents, children, and friends for their support. In addition to thanking those that have supported you, we hope you will take time to engage online and shout it out across the world and within the university community. You can do so in several ways. Right now, you can view and forward a special video clip of you. This clip is made for sharing, and we want you to celebrate this accomplishment and shout it from the rooftops. Each of you can visit our graduate clip website to view your photo or video clip and then easily share it on social media so that all your friends and family members can celebrate virtually. These clips will be played as part of the calling of the names, where each of you will be individually recognized after the formal speaking portion of our ceremony. Graduates will be announced in alphabetical order by academic school and then 
by name. If you are unsure of your academic school, you can visit our AMU or APU websites and search for your degree. The order of announcement will be the School of Arts, Humanities, and Education, the Wallace E. Boston School of Business, the School of Health Sciences, the School of Science, Technology, Engineering, and Math, and the School of Security and Global Studies. Even though we cannot be together in person, we hope that you enjoy your ceremony. Additionally, all classes of 2020 and 2021 graduates are invited to attend the Class of 2022 ceremony on June 18th, 2022. So save that date. We promise it will be a special event for all three graduating classes. Now, we will continue our celebration with a word from our Board of Trustees Chair, General Alfred Gray, followed by Dr. Wade Dyke's inaugural presidential address. After President Dyke's address, we will hear the keynote speech from Lieutenant General Vincent Stewart and a message from your class speaker, Mr. Eric Sneed. Get ready for some inspiring words for this special day of celebration. Good morning and good afternoon. I'm Al Gray and privileged to be the chairman of the American Public University System Board of Trustees. On behalf of our trustees, our faculty, our dedicated staff, and our 107,000 alumni, congratulations. We wish we could get together in person as it is always exciting to watch our graduates walk across the stage upon receiving their diplomas. For nearly 30 years of involvement with the university, I've been privileged to be a part of this. In the early days, our faculty would meet in my library at my home. How great it is today that we can reach so many active duty, veterans, and public service personnel through our online campus. You will have some wonderful stories to tell your children about how you finished your degree during these unprecedented days. We are particularly impressed that three of you are 18 years old and that one of you finished at the age of 84. <laughs> You're catching up with me. We also want to make special mention of our graduates serving in our Army, Navy, Air Force, Coast Guard, and Marines. The most important responsibility you have is to take care of the people you are privileged to lead. Take care of yourselves, take care of each other. God bless, and as we say in the nation's Corps of Marines, Semper Fidelis. 
We are excited for the next chapter. Class of 2021 graduates and guests, I now present to you the president of American Public University System, Dr. Wade Dyke. Thank you, General Gray. I'm Wade Dyke, and it's my honor to serve as your university president. Congratulations to each of you for forging ahead and achieving your degree. This is never easy in ordinary times and remarkable during these times. Extraordinary times require extraordinary people, and we found them in you. The class of 2021 recognizes over 14,000 graduates, our largest graduating class ever. You come from 60 countries, that's six zero, 60 countries around the world. Your hard work is a remarkable story of resilience that binds our university together, one complemented by the commitment of our faculty and our staff. And this year, your year, we've reached a new milestone in our history. Your achievements and everyone who celebrates with us today are all part of our prestigious 30th anniversary graduating class. Behind me in the lobby of our Student Services Building, we tell about our history. And a special individual instrumental in this story has joined me today. For nearly half of our 30 years as an institution, Dr. Wallace Boston served as our university president. Dr. Boston, thank you for celebrating with us today. Thank you, President Dyke. In 1991, retired Marine Corps officer James P. Etter established American Military University which would go on to become the number one educator to the United States Armed Forces and Veterans. Soon after, with the advent of American Public University, we expanded our scope to provide education to professionals who hold critical responsibilities and a deep sense of public service. Today, after 30 astounding years, you join an exceptional cadre of graduates who are making a profound difference for our nation. At this time, we would like to share a few highlights of our story, 30 years in the making, a story that all of you have now helped to write. We are honored to have Lieutenant General Vincent Stewart as our commencement speaker. General Stewart is the Chief Innovation and Business Intelligence Officer at Ankara, a global consulting company based in Washington, D.C. He is a results-oriented leader with over 30 years experience in all aspects of cyberspace operations, intelligence, and counterintelligence. General Stewart's expertise 
is in developing high-performing teams and implementing innovative strategies, plans, and initiatives while driving process improvements to attain objectives and goals. During a military career that has spanned nearly four decades, General Stewart has served in many senior roles, including Deputy Commander of the United States Cyber Command, Commanding General of the Marine Forces Cyber Command, and Director of Intelligence for the United States Marine Corps. As Deputy Commander of the U.S. Cyber Command, he provided strategic leadership to more than 10,000 personnel, executing the full spectrum of cyberspace operations. That work included the securing of the Department of Defense's information network, which consisted of 3 million users in 140 countries across 15,000 networks and 6,000 physical locations. Whew. General Stewart also planned and organized the Department of Defense's efforts to secure our nation's critical infrastructure and key resources against malicious cyber threats. He established policies and obtained authority for conducting cyberspace operations. Before that, as the director of the Defense Intelligence Agency, General Stewart effectively managed a global organization of over 16,000 personnel operating in more than 100 countries, delivering intelligence on the military capabilities of potential adversaries. He provided intelligence briefings to the President of the United States and national security staff regarding emerging threats and opportunities, as well as giving regular threat briefings to Congress to inform policies and budget decisions impacting the Department of Defense. In this role, General Stewart also served as the principal advisor to the Secretary of Defense and the chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff. Following his military service, General Stewart founded and served as Chief Executive of Stewart Global Solutions, an international consulting company focused on cybersecurity, geopolitical intelligence, strategic planning, and crisis management services. Please join me in welcoming Lieutenant General Vincent Stewart. Vernon, thank you for that very gracious introduction. I'm honored to be here and thrilled to participate in this unique and momentous event. I use the term unique to acknowledge that we are doing this commencement in a virtual environment. Who would have thought two years ago that we would do events like these in a virtual setting? But here we are. It's unique because of the challenges you will face as you begin or continue your journey. And it is unique because you must define yourself in a world that is undefined, uncertain, and chaotic. More chaotic than any time that I can remember in my 40 years of service. You all know this. A traditional co commencement creates an opportunity for newly minted graduates, bachelors, masters, and doctoral candidates to be recognized before their friends and family, have their degrees conferred upon them, and begin the next phase of their journey armed with greater knowledge and insights, ready to take on the challenges of the world. This commencement is unique not simply because we're doing this in a virtual environment as a result of the COVID-19 pandemic, but because of the challenges of the world. Great power competition, economic uncertainty, social injustice, climate anomalies, radicalism, and I could go on. You're about to embark upon or return to a world that will demand your commitment, your intellect, your engagement, and the full application of what you've learned during this part of your journey. I won't comment further on the challenges you all will face. This should be an uplifting moment, and it is far too troubling a world if I head down that path. The class of 2021 is composed of graduates from August 2020 through June 2021. The class of 2021 currently includes 14,275 graduates. More than 60 countries across the world are represented to include Australia, Bahrain, Belgium, Canada, Ecuador, Ethiopia, Georgia, Germany, Israel, Italy, Japan, Micronesia, Netherlands, New Zealand, Norway, 
Oman, Pakistan, the Philippines, South Korea, Uganda, and locations across the United States. We have graduates ranging from 18 year old to 80 plus years old. So the first thing I must do is congratulate you all for your accomplishment in attaining your degrees, your persistence in this challenging environment, and your commitment to learning and improving your personal brand. Now this is where the keynote speaker offers his or her advice that will ensure your future success. Okay, maybe it won't guarantee success, but hopefully it gives you an opportunity to ponder some things that may be helpful along the way. Number one, have fun. Don't take yourself or life too seriously. Find ways to have fun, relieve stress, find a hobby that gets you away from your desk, gets you outdoors, and one that can easily incorporate friends and family. Number two, begin with the end in mind. In this case, I don't mean what you hope to be remembered for professionally, but how you'll be viewed by your friends and family. We often think of our legacy at the office. I want each of you to think about your legacy as a person. I found out this year as a result of COVID that I fall in the elderly category. When you fall into that category, how will you be viewed? What will your legacy be as a spouse, a mother, a brother, or a friend? Will you find pictures that bring back great memories, songs that stir your heart, memories of vacation that bring tears of joy to your eyes, stories at family gatherings that you had forgotten but had a profound and positive impact on your children? Or will your life be defined by your professional accomplishments? Since there are no do-overs in life, you must begin now to think of where you want to be as a, quote, elderly person. Number three, be a lifelong learner. You don't have to pursue a higher degree to be a lifelong learner. But as you come to this point of your, of your education journey, I trust that it will not be the last time any of you pick up a book. Try reading something daily. Try reading something that is out of your area of expertise. Read the biographies of great leaders of the world, even if they're flawed. Read more, watch television less, and stay away from social media readings. I wish you all great success, a life of happiness, friends who enjoy your company, and a bit of knowledge about all things relevant to the world in which you live. God bless you all and wishing you great success. Thank you, General Stewart. I'd like to welcome class of 2021 graduate class speaker, Mr. Eric Sneed. Eric began his military and public service career after graduating high school in 2001. He joined the Marine Corps as an air traffic control specialist, serving five years and completing tours of duty that included Operation Enduring Freedom and Operation Iraqi Freedom. After leaving the Marine Corps, Eric continued to serve his country as an air traffic controller for the Army at Fort Campbell, Kentucky. In 2012, he joined the Federal Aviation Administration, the FAA, as an air traffic control specialist. Since joining the FAA, Eric has served in multiple roles, including certified professional controller, operations supervisor, air traffic safety inspector, and Supervisory Air Traffic Control Specialist. Recently, he became one of the Air Traffic Organization's top five program managers, reducing risk within the national airspace system. Eric has a Bachelor of Applied Science and Technology with a special emphasis in air traffic control from Thomas Edison State University in Trenton, New Jersey. He also holds a Master of Arts in Management with a specialization in organizational leadership from American Military University. To improve the lives of military veterans, Eric founded the Never Alone Veterans Association, or NAVA, to assist veterans in obtaining benefits earned through their military service. NAVA also provides meals and supplies to homeless veterans in the local community. Eric hopes to be a role model for his children 
and with anyone he comes in contact. Eric, welcome and thank you for your service. Good morning, my fellow graduates, faculty, family, friends, and guests. I consider it an honor and a privilege to be able to address you on this momentous occasion. For many of us, today is the culmination of a very challenging academic journey. For others, it's just a pit stop. All of our journeys brought us together here today, and whichever category you fall in, take time to celebrate yourself and your accomplishments on this day, because we did it. To say that last year, and even the first half of 2021 has been a challenge, would be the understatement of the century. Our world is in a place I'm sure none of us could have ever imagined, and we've lost so much because of the pandemic. Despite everything that has happened, we overcame it all. Look around you. Every graduate you see today is an overcomer. Whether it was health issues, career challenges, or financial concerns, and oh yeah, don't forget those student loan payments kick in in six months, but we made it. Nelson Mandela once said, what counts in life is not the mere fact that we have lived. It is what difference we have made to the lives of others that will determine the significance of the life we lead. It is our time to make a difference. It is our time to change the world for the better. No matter how big or small, the changes we make will have ripple effects that will be felt further than we will ever know. So what's next? What challenge will you take head on? How will you collaborate, integrate, and innovate with the things you have learned throughout your time here? Whatever you decide, be bold. Know that no matter how difficult the task and the number of obstacles that will be placed in your way, you are an AP US graduate and you are destined for greatness. Finally, I'd like to thank our families, spouses, and children who have sacrificed their time with us to allow for discussion posts to be submitted, papers to be edited and turned in, and group Zoom calls throughout the week. Our success could not have been possible without your support. I leave you with a poem entitled Invictus by William Ernest Henley. Out of the night that covers me, black as the pit from pole to pole, I think whatever gods may be for my unconquerable soul. In the fell clutch of circumstance, I have not winced nor cried aloud. Under the bludgeonings of chance, my head is bloody but unbowed. Beyond this place of wrath and tears looms but the horror of the shade, and yet the menace of the years finds and shall find me unafraid. It matters not how straight the gate, how charged with punishments the scroll. I am the master of my fate. I am the captain of my soul. Congratulations, graduates. I wish you success and so much more. Thank you. Thank you, Eric. What a wonderful message. You are an inspiration to us all. Now, it's the moment you've been waiting for. President Dyke, I am pleased to present to you American Public University Systems candidates for the class of 2021. I'm Dr. Grace Glass, Dean of the School of Arts, Humanities, and Education. I'm so proud of you and wish you and your families all the best on this commencement day. Your names will now be announced in alphabetical order. I would like to congratulate all the graduates of the class of 2021. You did it. Nazar Altamimi, Master of Arts, History. My name is Nazar Altamimi. I am from Louisville, Kentucky, and I am Master of Arts, History, AMU graduate. Forest Barber, Master of Arts, History. Andrew Bragg, Master of Arts, History. Brian Chavez, Master of Arts, History. Congrats, class of 2021. It has been a difficult year, but nonetheless, we graduate today. Congratulations to all graduates. Thane Conrad, Master of Arts, History. 
Thank you to all my family and friends and the awesome APU instructors who helped me get here. Congratulations, graduates of class of 2021. Go APU. Carla Ferris, Master of Arts, History. <laughs> Katrine Geary, Master of Arts, History. Elendriel Green, Master of Arts, History. Robin Hartzell, Master of Arts, History. Matthew Hastings. Master of Arts, History. I earned my Master's in History from APUS. Thank you so much for the opportunity. I'd like to thank my family, my wife, my friends, and all the faculty at APUS. Thank you so much. Heather Hausa, Master of Arts, History. Genevieve Kemp, Master of Arts, History. Jonathan Lines, Master of Arts, History. I'd like to say thank you to everyone for all of their support and encouragement, and congratulations, class of 2021. Denise McNeff, Master of Arts, History. I'd like to thank my husband, Clayton McNeff, and our three children and our family and our friends for an encouraging and supporting me. I love you all. Alfred Mori Kong, Master of Arts, History. I am Alfred Teacher Mori a proud graduate from the American Public University. I would like to thank my family and all my friends for their support. Twyla Petrie, Master of Arts, History. Dale Robbins, Master of Arts, History. Zion Smiley, Master of Arts, History. Congratulations, class of 2021. We did it. It's hard to believe that we're here. We started out about two years ago, maybe some of us have been longer. We finally have reached this point. Chelsea Zukowski, Master of Arts. History. Anthony Lee Chestnut, Master of Arts, Humanities. Ian Green, Master of Arts, Military History. Eileen Elizabeth Kelly, Master of Arts, Military History. Matthew Krug. Master of Arts, Military History. David Maxwell, Master of Arts, Military History. Kristen Barrier, Master of Arts, Psychology. Darnell Bowden, Master of Arts, Psychology. Devin Fields, Master of Arts, Psychology. Hope Grant, Master of Arts, Psychology. Thank you, APU, for everything. Sierra Grimm. Master of Arts, Psychology. Shannon Michelle Hairston, Master of Arts, Psychology. Kristen LeRae Jackson, Master of Arts, Psychology. I just want to say thanks to all my family and friends, especially my husband and Thomas, and I finally did it. Lindsay Knock, 
Master of Arts, Psychology. Keelan Ledger, Master of Arts, Psychology. Reynazel Manzano, Master of Arts, Psychology. Marsha Metzer, Master of Arts, Psychology. Aliyah Mujahid, Master of Arts, Psychology. Anna Reyes, Master of Arts, Psychology. Kelly Sally, Master of Arts, Psychology. Amy Dunlap, Master of Education. Vanessa Hernandez, Master of Education. Lori and Kenny, Master of Education. Tarsha Miller, Master of Education. Marquis Pullen, Master of Education. So first I want to thank God, I want to thank my family, my wife and kids, I want to thank AMU staff, everyone for being a part of this journey. Congratulations. Thank you. Catherine Schwartz, Master of Education. Wendell Spivey. Master of Education. Jermaine Dwight Thomas. Master of Education. Hi. I'm Dr. Marie Harper, Dean of the Wallace E. Boston School of Business. I am so proud of you and wish you and your families all the best on this commencement day. Your names will now be announced in alphabetical order. I would like to congratulate all the graduates of the class of 2021. You did it! Jessica Askew, Master of Arts, Entrepreneurship, Jacob Froreich, Master of Arts, Entrepreneurship. Dominic Drix Helms, Master of Arts, Entrepreneurship. I'm so proud of myself to be sitting in front of everyone today virtually with my third degree in hand and my second master's. Thank you to my family for all your support. I love you all. Akai Johnson, Master of Arts, Entrepreneurship. Montoya Alvarez, Master of Arts, Management. Sierra Ashley, Master of Arts, Management. Jeffrey Bartram, Master of Arts, Management. Thaddeus Butler, Master of Arts, Management. Ava Cooper, Master of Arts, Management. Hello, my name is Ava Cooper. I'm a graduate from American Cooper University, class of 2020 a master's degree in management and a master's certificate in government. Trevor Davis, Master of Arts, Management. Jenna DePonto, 
Master of Arts, Management, Nicole Eggert Robinson, Master of Arts, Management, Jamie Renee Ellerby, Master of Arts, Management, Laura Farrell, Master of Arts, Management, Kimberly Gold, Master of Arts, Management, Daniel Hale, Master of Arts, Management, Melissa Curtis, Master of Arts, Management, thank my family today my amazing daughter my sister my brother my mom my husband who's been so supportive throughout this whole process thank you so much jesse harris master of arts management phyllis hughes master of arts management Victoria Nicole Hughes, Master of Arts, Management. Terrell Jackson, Master of Arts, Management. Laquisha Lovejoy Johnson, Master of Arts, Management. Jimo Lewis, Master of Arts, Management. Alan Lupi, Master of Arts, Management. Luis Martinez, Master of Arts, Management. Eddie Dean Moore II, Master of Arts, Management. Edward Mounts, Master of Arts, Management. Tiffany Murphy, Master of Arts, Management. Carolyn Peterson, Master of Arts, Management. Jared Redfern, Master of Arts, Management. Yes! Xiomara Ross, Master of Arts, Management. Today my degree is dedicated to God, my family, my friends, and to my amazing husband. Babe, thank you so much for encouraging me, pushing me all the way through to the finish line. I love you. Jonas Salas Menchaca, Master of Arts, Management. Angela Esposito Sargent, Master of Arts, Management. Brittany Smith, Master of Arts, Management. Eric Sneed, Master of Arts, Management. Dimitri Sotos, Master of Arts, Management. I did it. <laughs> Dilmona Stepanpour, Master of Arts, Management. Crystal Tutine, Master of Arts, Management. Elena Walla, Master of Arts. Management Ivy Marnay Watkins, Master of Arts, Management 
Penny Wedbetter. Master of Arts. Management. Antonio McMillan. Master of Arts. Reverse Logistics Management. If you ever won the 2021 graduation, congratulations, hard work, job well done. Bidemi Olajid. Master of Arts. Reverse Logistics Management. Class of 2021, congratulations! Hi, I'm Bidemi Olajid. I'm so glad we made it to the end of this program. Now it's our time, let's go make impact. William Hirsch. Master of Arts, Supply Chain Management. Jody Ruth, Master of Arts, Supply Chain Management. Bernadette Smith, Master of Arts, Supply Chain Management. Talonda Brown, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. It's such an honor to go to AMU to finish my master's degree. I am now in my field working for the government. Once again, once again, thank you, AMU, for allowing me. Kenneth Butler, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Quinton Eccles, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. I want to thank my wife, my kids, my family, my friends, thank you everybody for helping me persevere to meet this goal. Thank you all. Paul Edward Evans Jr. Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Daniel Faili, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Carson Gregory, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Christine Henning, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Chad Hinkle, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Chauncey Hodge, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Stephen Hohenschelt, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Tanya Johnson, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Joseph Miller, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Hi everyone. I want to give thanks to all my family and friends that supported me along the way for a long, over 10 years. I finally made it. On to the next. Derek Nicholas, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Kevin Scott Painter, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Jason Renier, Master of Arts. Transportation and Logistics Management. Contessa Rose, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Juan Sepulveda Cadavid, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. John Thomas, Master of Arts, Transportation and Logistics Management. Thank you to my Lord Jesus Christ, my wife, Bang, and our two wonderful boys, Jacob and Noah. Thank you all so much. Couldn't have done this without you. Joshua Adelsberger, Master of Business Administration. Motasim al Kadib, Master of Business Administration. Titania Allen, Master of Business Administration. Trevor Reinhardt Burr, Master of Business Administration. Simon Bowser, Master of Business Administration. 
huge thank you to my family and all the staff at AMU for making the MBA endeavor my pleasure. Gerland Broscom, Master of Business Administration. I did it! Yay! Guadalupe Cantu, Master of Business Administration. Mario Sarija, Master of Business Administration. Shadonica Crawford, Master of Business Administration. Victoria Elliott, Master of Business Administration. Elizabeth Fernandez, Master of Business Administration. John Gallagher, Master of Business Administration. Jeffrey Gobin, Master of Business Administration. Danielle Grafignino, Master of Business Administration. Weston Hall, Master of Business Administration. Congrats to the class of 2021 at AMU. Keep on learning and keep on living. Rodney Herring, Master of Business Administration. Thank you, AMU, for enabling me to grow and be a better person. Thank you. Nicholas Hudson, Master of Business Administration. David Jeffcoat, Master of Business Administration. I'd like to thank my wife and my kids, my family and my in-laws, and my late granddad as I have their unwavering support for the last year and a half as I completed my master's in business administration. Tara Juizaitis, Master of Business Administration. Anthony Casco. Master of Business Administration. Chanda Kearney. Master of Business Administration. Hi, I'm Chanda Kearney, and I'd like to thank all of my supporters. Best of luck to my classmates. Go Class of 2021. Kiana Kelleher. Master of Business Administration. Kelvin Corumba, Master of Business Administration. Thank you, Sarah Jane. Thank you, kids. Thank you, Mom. And finally, thank you to the United States Army. We did it. Franklin Lee, Master of Business Administration. Thank you to everyone and congratulations, class of 2021. Tara Milligan, Master of Business Administration. A degree from APU. I'd like to thank my family for all of their support and extend and congratulations to the class of 2021. Otilia Moore, Master of Business Administration. Brian Lee Peter Jr., Master of Business Administration. Sherry Powers, Master of Business Administration. Christina Rodriguez, Master of Business Administration. Christopher San Miguel, Master of Business Administration. Brittany Shakarian, Master of Business Administration. 
Thank you so much to my family for all the support and encouragement you've given me. I'm finally here, and I definitely wouldn't be here without you. I love you. Savali, Master of Business Administration. Stephen Stilly, Master of Business Administration. Gerald Vasquez, Master of Business Administration. Thank you to all my friends and family for all the support. We did it. Yay! Yay! Stephen Vesely, Master of Business Administration. Amy Walker, Master of Business Administration. Russell Wilbanks, Master of Business Administration. Terry and Williams Hall, Master of Business Administration. Amy Mitchell, Master of Science, Accounting. Shannon Heather Stowe, Master of Science, Accounting. Caroline Swanaker, Master of Science, Accounting. Misael Villatoro, Master of Science, Accounting. Cody Gaspar, Master of Science, Applied Business Analytics. Katharina James, Master of Science, Applied Business Analytics. Congratulations to all my fellow graduates. Even if graduation looks a little bit different this year, it doesn't take away from your accomplishments. Kudos, and I'm thankful for everyone I met. Samuel Sanfortello, Master of Science, Applied Business Analytics. Jamie Schmidt, Master of Science, Applied Business Analytics. I'm Dr. Brian Freeland, Dean of the School of Health Sciences. I am so proud of you and wish you and your families all the best on this commencement day. Your names will now be announced in alphabetical order. I would like to congratulate all of the graduates of the class of 2021. You did it. Ariel Bell. Master of Public Health. Kristen Dearborn. Master of Public Health. Jacqueline Duan Vieira. Master of Public Health. Camilla Green. Master of Public Health. Megan Hill, Master of Public Health. Ashley Jackson, Master of Public Health. Sasha Johnson, Master of Public Health. Lisette Mercado. Master of Public Health. Linda Robinson Moffat. Master of Public Health. Jelana Robinson. Master of Public Health. Jacob Snyder. Master of Public Health. Brittany Tolbert. Master of Public Health. Karen Tribble. Master of Public Health. Paris Walker. Master of Public Health. Carlene Washington Wortham, 
Master of Public Health. Amanda Brawley, Master of Science, Athletic Development Management. Chardonnay Ford, Master of Science, Athletic Development Management. Noe Lonnie Herben Hervig, Master of Science, Athletic Development Management. Thank you to the faculty and staff at AMU and to my family, especially my husband and children, for allowing me to pursue this goal. Coffee Apley, Master of Science, Health Information Management. Hello, this coffee. Christine Hall, Master of Science, Health Information Management. Kara Campbell, Master of Science, Healthcare Administration. Sherita Copper, Master of Science, Healthcare Administration. Hello everyone, congratulations to all the graduates. Thank you for my friend who was right by my side. Thank you for my daughter who was right by my side. My friends and family, God bless you. Keandra Gibson, Master of Science, Healthcare Administration. Thank you all for coming out and sharing this milestone with me. I always remember, reach beyond the stars. Evelyn Mensa, Master of Science, Healthcare Administration. Gianna Rice, Master of Science, Healthcare Administration. Chief Victor Walker, Sr., Master of Science, Healthcare Administration. Denise Diver, Master of Science, Nursing. Brittany Briscoe, Master of Science, Sports and Health Sciences. Joy Bryant, Master of Science, Sports and Health Sciences. Abdu Kamarda, Master of Science, Sports and Health Sciences. Teresa Edlow, Master of Science, Sports and Health Sciences. John Hill, Master of Science, Sports and Health Sciences. Adriana Martinez, Master of Science, Sports and Health Sciences. Jessica McDivitt, Master of Science, Sports and Health Sciences. Renee Sampson, Master of Science, Sports and Health Sciences. Keendra Shelton, Master of Science, Sports and Health Sciences. Hello everybody, I just wanted to give a quick shout out to my parents, my family, and my real close friends for making sure I stay motivated until I made it to this day. Mariah Corin Smelser, Master of Science, Sports and Health Sciences. We graduate God, Family, Grinding, Hustle, and most importantly, Katniss Tiger Lily, Master of Science, Sports and Health Sciences, Nandi Awad, Master of Science, Sports Management, John Burke, Master of Science, Sports Management, Arthur R. Hawkins Jr. Master of Science, Sports Management. Amanda Lewis, Master of Science, Sports Management. Andrew Littleton, Master of Science, Sports Management. Derek McGraw, Master of Science, Sports Management. The entire staff at American Public University has been an honor. I'm honored to earn my master's degree, but the journey continues. Francis Dale Sider, 
Master of Science, Sports Management, Elizabeth Tidwell, Master of Science, Sports Management. I want to thank AMU for helping me obtain my master's degree along with my family for being a motivational force so that I can obtain my goal. Hello, I'm Dr. Ahmed Nauman, Dean of the School of Science, Technology, Engineering, and Mathematics. I'm so proud of you and wish you and your families all the best in this commencement day. Your names will now be announced in alphabetical order. I would like to congratulate all the graduates of the class of 2021. You did it! Nkamago Cha, Master of Science, Cybersecurity Studies, Congratulations to the class of 2021, master's degree in cybersecurity from American Public University. We made it today. Yay! Emmanuel Aguero, Master of Science, Cybersecurity Studies. Dedico este día especial a mi tío Franz Jean-Louis, que conocía el valor de una educación y siempre me empujó en mis estudios. James Asbury. Master of Science, Cybersecurity Studies. Mark Heath, Master of Science, Cybersecurity Studies. Hi everyone, I'm happy to graduate from AMU with a Master's in Cybersecurity Studies. Thank you to my professors, classmates, family, and friends. A special thank you to my wife, Arlene. Angel Lane, Master of Science, Cybersecurity Studies. Robert Lopez, Master of Science, Cybersecurity Studies. Bree Nedick, Master of Science, Cybersecurity Studies. Derek Westmoreland, Master of Science, Cybersecurity Studies. Congratulations, class of 2021. We've done it. We've accomplished what we set out to do. Good luck, Semper Fidelis. Daniel Wolford, Master of Science, Cybersecurity Studies. Michael Antone, Master of Science, Environmental Policy and Management. Rana Benini, Master of Science, Environmental Policy and Management. Ashley Brooks, Master of Science, Environmental Policy and Management. Hannah Faber, Master of Science, Environmental Policy and Management. Lee Gregory, Master of Science, Environmental Policy and Management. Hi, my name is Leanne Gregory. I'm getting a Master's of Science in Environmental Science, Policy and Management. I'm so excited to be graduating this Kelsey Guidry, Master of Science, Environmental Policy and Management. Angel McCoy, Master of Science, Environmental Policy and Management. I finally have my master's degree. Thank you to the Bureau of Ocean Energy Management for your financial support. And thank you to my husband Q for being my constant cheerleader. Samantha Mallow, Master of Science, Environmental Policy and Management. Mary Stephan Deaton, Master of Science, Environmental Policy and Management. Alicia Simons, Master of Science, Environmental Policy and Management. Victoria White, Master of Science, Environmental Policy and Management. Thanks everyone for supporting me in this accomplishment and thank you to the professors at APU for leading me on this journey. Daniel Fay, Master of Science, Information Technology. Brandon Pedersen, Master of Science, Information Technology. 
Adam Rafferty. Master of Science. Information Technology. Nicholas Andrew Hoodley. Master of Science. Space Studies. Well, this is awkward. 10 second limit, huh? Well, thank you to my instructors, my family, and my friends. Shirley Davis. Master of Science. Space Studies. Natalie Eidsness, Master of Science, Space Studies. Carmel La Maria House, Master of Science, Space Studies. Michael Pachomsky, Master of Science, Space Studies. Derek Romanik, Master of Science, Space Studies. Ron Wilson, Master of Science, Space Studies. I'm Dr. Mark Riccardi, Dean of the School of Security and Global Studies. I'm so proud of you and wish you and your families all the best on this commencement day. Your names will now be announced in alphabetical order. I would like to congratulate all the graduates of the class of 2021. You did it! Dallas Ayers, Master of Arts, Criminal Justice. Jeffrey Carter, Master of Arts, Criminal Justice. Thank you to everyone, my family, my friends, Thank God. Thank you at the faculty at AMU, and good luck to everyone in the future. Sherry Sachin Gonzalez, Master of Arts, Criminal Justice. Shankita D. Hill Kemp, Master of Arts, Criminal Justice. Leticia Ortega, Master of Arts, Criminal Justice. Danielle Roberts, Master of Arts, Criminal Justice. Jennifer Stenger, Master of Arts, Criminal Justice. I just wanted to say thank you to God, my daughter, my family, and everyone who has guided me in my journey to graduate. As Milton Berle said, if opportunity doesn't knock, build a door. Thank you. Corey Wallace, Master of Arts, Criminal Justice. Michael Francis Wren Jr. Master of Arts. Criminal Justice. Douglas Bruce. Master of Arts. Emergency and Disaster Management. Hey everyone, I just want to thank all of my professors, my classmates. It was a truly awesome experience to be able to go through the program at AMU. Deborah Cushman, Master of Arts, Emergency and Disaster Management. Lakeshia Estes, Master of Arts, Emergency and Disaster Management. Ingrid Foster, Master of Arts, Emergency and Disaster Management. Yay! I did it! Zachary Gibbons, Master of Arts, Emergency and Disaster Management. Anthony Hernandez, Master of Arts, Emergency and Disaster Management. Iram Kamar Khan, Master of Arts, Emergency and Disaster Management. Scott Maynard, Master of Arts, Emergency and Disaster Management. I'd like to thank my wife and my four children. Thank you for all your support and loving devotion.
It's been great and it's over. Thank God. Antonio Estefan Madeira. Master of Arts. Emergency and Disaster Management. Don Ash. Master of Arts. Emergency and Disaster Management. I would like to take this opportunity to say thank you to my wife, Amelia, my family and friends, and everyone that helped me with this journey. We made it to God and made it. Joanna Wettstein. Master of Arts. Emergency and Disaster Management and Homeland Security. Joshua Carandang. Master of Arts. Homeland Security. Sabrina Coates. Master of Arts. Homeland Security. Matthew Creedon. Master of Arts. Homeland Security. Natalie Gilchrist. Master of Arts. Homeland Security. Matthew House. Master of Arts, Homeland Security. Terry Hibbert Romero, Master of Arts, Homeland Security. Andre Johnson, Master of Arts, Homeland Security. Keith McEckern, Master of Arts, Homeland Security. Rajiv Shrestha, Master of Arts, Homeland Security. Muhammad Sully, Master of Arts, Homeland Security. Tara Thompson, Master of Arts, Homeland Security. Quinton Trent, Master of Arts, Homeland Security. Quentin Trent, Master of Arts of Homeland Security. I dedicate this degree in memory of Marie A. Trent, my mother. I thank my wife Tanya for her support. Friendship is essential to the soul. Hannah Troxel, Master of Arts, Homeland Security. Keegan Bailey, Master of Arts, Intelligence Studies. Kevin Beatty. Master of Arts, Intelligence Studies. Thomas Brady, Master of Arts, Intelligence Studies. Melissa Chandler, Master of Arts, Intelligence Studies. Nicole Davis Thrower, Master of Arts, Intelligence Studies. Congratulations to all of my peers. All of our hard work has finally paid off. Best of luck in all your endeavors. Catherine Del Valle, Master of Arts, Intelligence Studies. Derek Elliott, Master of Arts, Intelligence Studies. Yemlibika Futkulin, Master of Arts. Intelligence Studies. I am Yamlibi Kefat Kulin. I would like to thank the university, my faculty advisor, Dr. Sean, and all those who helped and support me in this program. Mark Frieda, Master of Arts, Intelligence Studies. Danilo Frisoli, Master of Arts, Intelligence Studies. Thank you, America Mita University, for this tremendous opportunity. Catherine Herrera, Master of Arts, Intelligence Studies. Shannon Hubbard, Master of Arts, Intelligence Studies. Shout out to my friends, my family, my fiance. I finally did it. Anton Kahn, Master of Arts. Intelligence Studies. Ryan Jeffrey Mann. Master of Arts. Intelligence Studies. Deja McKenzie. Master of Arts. 
Intelligence Studies Christopher D. Mortimer Master of Arts Intelligence Studies Bronlin Patterson Master of Arts Intelligence Studies I'm Bronlin Patterson and I want to give a huge thank you to God, to my parents, to my sisters, and especially to my husband who kept the wine flowing those late Sunday nights. We did it! Kendra Rayburn Master of Arts Intelligence Studies Igor Safariantz Master of Arts Intelligence Studies Adam Starzik Master of Arts Intelligence Studies Charles Tennis Master of Arts Intelligence Studies Haiyan Zhang Master of Arts Intelligence Studies Michael Burt Master of Arts International Relations and Conflict Resolution My name is Captain Mike Burt of the Royal Canadian Air Force To my fellow graduates, I wish you all the best of luck in your future endeavors Emma Olin Master of Arts International Relations and Conflict Resolution I am ecstatic to officially be graduated Thank you so much to my wonderful mom, amazing boyfriend Paul, and all of the great AMU teachers. John Ramirez, Master of Arts, International Relations and Conflict Resolution. Benjamin Saxe, Master of Arts, International Relations and Conflict Resolution. Got this. Got this. Nice! <laughs> Robert Smith, Master of Arts, International Relations and Conflict Resolution. Sharon Stevens, Master of Arts, International Relations and Conflict Resolution. I would like to thank my husband, our children, my family, and friends for all of their support, especially the professors. Thank you. Jessica Weeman, Master of Arts, International Relations and Global Security. Timothy Clark, Master of Arts, Legal Studies. Elysia Jones, Master of Arts, Legal Studies. Adrian O'Faro, Master of Arts, Legal Studies. Chastity Tabor, Master of Arts, Legal Studies. This is Chastity Tabor with her master's degree from AMU in Legal Studies. 2020 graduate. Janie Jo Wilbur, Master of Arts. Legal Studies Paul DeLeo Master of Arts Military Studies Jeffrey Bates Master of Arts National Security Studies Don Eliezer Fernandez Master of Arts National Security Studies To my friends and family did it. I could not have done this without your unwavering support. Annette Okomo, Master of Arts, National Security Studies. Vladimir Polyus, Master of Arts, National Security Studies. Robert Tellez, Master of Arts, National Security Studies. Hello all, I'm happy to announce that I've achieved my goal of earning a master's degree of science and national security studies. Nicole Marie Burkhart, Master of Arts, Political Science. Tiffany Lindsay, 
Master of Arts, Political Science. Michael Kane, Master of Arts, Security Management. Brad Baragar, Master of Public Administration. Michael Carpenter, Master of Public Administration. Adrian Chambliss, Master of Public Administration. Alana Corrales, Master of Public Administration. Kimberly Kirshner, Master of Public Administration. Aaron Kubay, Master of Public Administration. Jessica Mayfield, Master of Public Administration. Jasmine Moore, Master of Public Administration. Chanel Moore, Master of Public Administration. Indira Nunez, Master of Public Administration. Simone Richardson, Master of Public Administration. Hi, this is Simone Richardson, and I just got my Master's in Public Administration with a concentration in Health Policy. Eric Samuel Williams, Master of Public Administration. MPA, baby! We did it! <laughs> Christy, we did it! I love you. We did it. Alicia Wiseman Shem, Master of Public Administration. Bradley LaShawn Fowler, Master of Public Policy. Clotilda Gauntlet Charles, Master of Public Policy. Kendi Old Shield. Master of Public Policy. Thank you, Mom, Terry, and Jonathan for all of your understanding and support, and Sky, River, and Rain for understanding when I had a pay-per-view. I love you all. Congratulations, Class of 2021. President Dyke, these candidates have fulfilled all requirements for their respective master's degrees, and it is with great pleasure that I present them to you. Master's degree candidates, please Rise. Upon the recommendation of the faculty and with authorization from the Board of Trustees, I confer upon you the master's degree with all the rights, privileges, and responsibilities pertaining thereunto. Graduates, please move your tassel from the right to left as a token and public symbol of your accomplishment. American Public University System's Board of Trustees, directors, faculty, and staff extend our sincere congratulations to you, our graduates, and now our alumni on the achievement of your educational goals. We have been privileged to support you in your endeavors. We wish you only the best in the future and encourage you to stay in touch. There are so many wonderful opportunities to stay connected to the university and your fellow graduates, such as involvement in various social media platforms, our peer mentoring program, and your alumni community, and much more. No matter where your accomplishments take you, we will always be here for you. Thank you, family and friends of our graduates, for the support you've given them and for being present at this celebration. We want to thank all of you who have made today and the continuing celebration possible. We hope you've enjoyed this celebration. Stay safe 
be well, and have a wonderful day. Thank you.